Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kyla Monarch coming to you with another review. But first, before I get into it, I just want to tell you guys, man, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for liking and sharing my content, my videos, all of my reviews. Thank you so much. Um, the feedback has been wonderful. It's been phenomenal. All I can say is thank you guys. Y'all are great. I really do appreciate y'all from the bottom of my heart, really and truly. Um, I wouldn't be able to do this channel without you guys and just want to say thank you. Uh, but today I'm doing the I'm doing a review today <laughs> on the Versa Carry Comfort. Flex Deluxe Holster. Yes. Yes. I have been wanting to do a review on VersaCarry holsters for a pretty good while now. So I was just only too ecstatic when I was able to purchase it and to see what it was all about. So again, this is how it came in the mail when I ordered it. And it comes in this plastic bag. That's it. But I'm going to pull it out so you guys can see it better. And also inside the envelope is your receipt. You know, when you purchased it. And also they send you a flyer that says that they will give you 50% off if you do a social media review. And they'll give um, $150 store credit if you do a YouTube review. So I think that's pretty great. Okay, that's that's a nice thing that uh, Versi Carry is doing. So I like that. That's pretty good. Um, so without for without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this review. Yeah, that rhyme. Without further ado, let's get into this review. Hey, but anyway, <laughs> all right, guys. This is what you have. This is the VersaCarry Comfort Flex Deluxe Holster. It is inside waistband, as you can tell. And it's a pretty nice looking holster, if I should uh if I if I can say so myself. Um, I ordered it in the Distress Brown, and it's made out of the wild buffalo leather. Um, the belt, um, I don't want to say the belt. Well, I guess you could say the belt clip. It's in there pretty tight. The tension on it is tight. I'm going to bring this a little closer so you guys can see that. And you see how it's inside of that leather right there? How it's in there? Can you see that? And of course, that is the logo for VersaCarry right there. That same logo is also back here on the back, okay? This back area is this foam um, material that's supposed to be more comfortable up against your skin, okay? And up against your stomach. Won't have that rash and that uncomfortable feeling with the cuts and scratches and all of that. So I'm liking this foam material back here. Um, and of course... All of this is leather here, okay? And this is VersaCaris. Um, this is like the part of the holster where you can tell definitely this is a VersaCaris product. These uh, areas right over here, they almost look like little vents or something like that. But yeah, this really, this really a telltale sign that it's a true VersaCaris holster. And of course, here is the tension screw here, just in case you want to make this holster a little tighter. That go, you know, when your firearm sits in here, you know, you can tighten it up or you can loosen it up. Just use a Phillip head screwdriver. And I've shown you that in one of my previous videos. So um, you'll be able to do that. Okay. So this um, foam material back here. It's also supposed to be used, um, you know, you know, I told y'all in previous videos, <laughs> I hear noises, um, my head is on a swivel, 
Okay, so if I hear something out the ordinary, animal or not, human or not, whatever the case may be, my head is on a swivel. Because I'm always looking around, okay? Uh, when I hear something that don't sound like it's supposed to be going on, I'm, I'm looking around. But, okay, so back to um, this foam area back here. This, um, this material also is supposed to help with sweating. Okay, because you know, with us having a little bit more um, stuff going on around the stomach area, you know, and we're it's hot outside and we're walking around and all this other stuff, we tend to sweat sometimes. So, we need something to help with that sweat. So, it's not this wicker material that I normally am accustomed to seeing or what I have on my holster, the, the Galco holster. But this foam here is also, um, when you feel it, it kind of feels like it is memory foam a little bit. It kind of feels like it's memory foam. But this foam is, this foam is also supposed to help with, uh, with sweating. Okay. So that's something to, um, uh, think about it to remember as well. So now that we have kind of like did a thorough, well, I want to show you guys this too. This stitching here. This helps in keeping the gun secure inside of this holster. Okay. And I even like the way you already can tell the scratches in the leather. I don't know if you guys can see that good. But if you see like some scratches in this leather, that comes from that came from me. I already put in my EDC in here and pulling it out, pushing it in and pulling it out, okay? So that's where those scratches come from. The holster doesn't come like this when you buy it, but that just came from me um, just with normal use, okay? I just wanted to show you guys that. Okay, so now that we've kind of like looked over the holster and I am loving the extra fit stitching see that around here okay i like that and the same on the front heavy duty and when you look at it from the side you see the layering the leather here and then you have this foam material here okay same thing great stitching all over Okay, so now that we've looked this over, let's go ahead and put the uh, put my EDC inside and see how it does. Okay, okay. So this is my EDC. This is my Sis Soya P365. I'm hearing noises, y'all. <laughs> so this is my EDC. She is fully loaded, and I'm just gonna put her inside the holster. Okay, yes, you guys know I call her her. <laughs> and she fits very snug, very good, okay? She is not coming out. You see me holding um, holding this holster upside down? Um, the gun is sitting inside of this holster extremely well, okay? I'm not feeling anything coming out of this holster. My gun is not sliding out. So it's holding it pretty good. It's not even cadets. But this leather holster is holding this gun very well, I may add. Okay? Turn the um, right side up. Okay? Because this is the way that I will wear her inside of my pants on the side. You see the top part of the back of the holster here? Which means that when I put her on, put this holster on, it's gonna protect my skin from rubbing up against the edges of the slide of this handgun. Okay, so that's that's a good thing. That's one thing I'm loving. Okay, so now let's go ahead and put her inside of my pants here, and I'm gonna slide you guys down just just a little bit. Slide you guys down. Let's see. All right, here we go. Okay, so 
Remember, it's inside waistband, so that means it's going to go inside the actual, okay, inside the actual pants, okay? And we're going to lift this, we're going to lift this belt clip up, slide it down over the belt and the pants, okay? All right, very good. And there she sits. She sits in the holster, and the holster sits inside of my pants here. Okay, so you see that. All right, I hardly, I don't see any printing. Um, this top is working very well with this holster and my gun inside the holster, so you don't hardly see it. Um, I see something sticking out right here, but it's not noticeable. You know, it's not something that just sticking out like a sore thumb. You know, it seems like it's something that... It's blending in. You really can't tell what's there, but you know that something is there. You just don't know what it is, okay? Um, maybe if I push it forward or just a little. See, you really can't tell that I'm carrying it. Now, since I pushed the, um, since I pushed the, the grip toward the front just slightly, which means that I push the holster towards the front as well, okay? And it looks like this belt clip is at an angle so that if you do push it up to the front, it will accommodate that, okay? It won't give you no resistance if you were to push it to the front, okay? With the, um, through the grip, if you were to push the grip up front, okay? So... I think this is a winner. Um, this is really good the way it sits and it's situated. Like I said, you can't even tell that I'm carrying here. You don't see any printing going on or anything like that. That's pretty good. Okay, so I'm going to um, pan you guys back up just a little bit. I want you you to be able to see because I'm going to do a few draws from this holster okay um because I want to see exactly how it will perform if I was in a situation and I need to get to it right away how would the holster hold up will it stay on my um on my belt um how would the uh, can't hold up so far as staying secure and um things of that sort. So let's try that. Just, just maybe one or two times. Let's just try that, okay? Eyes on the target. Okay. Now that was okay, but as I was pulling the gun out, I felt something like tug, and maybe that was me pulling at this, okay? So, even with this holster, you're going to have to practice with it. Okay, so let's try that again. Let's try that draw again. Okay. And I'm comfortable here, by the way. I don't feel any type of irritation. I don't feel any scratching. Um, I don't feel any discomfort. Okay, this foam material... Is doing a fine job in keeping my stomach away from the top or the edge of this slide, which is good. I, it feels it feels very comfortable, by the way. Okay. All right, here we go. So, yep, no printing. Gun sticking out a little bit. Push it to the front just slightly. You can't tell anything. So let's try it again. Situation appears, eyes on the target. There we go. Let's try that again. One more time. Back into the holster. And the more times you put it inside this holster, the more that leather will stretch. Okay? The more times you pull it out and put it in, the more that leather will give and it will stretch. The leather will breathe and it will give you um, that room that you need. Okay? All right, one more time. 
situation appears, I, <laughs> I wasn't ready. <laughs> okay, situation appear, I on the target. I wasn't ready. See, shirt got all caught up in that. It doesn't matter. It still should come up off that belt. That belt clip, the bottom of that belt clip will, will keep your shirt. Let me show you guys that. Okay. You see the bottom of that belt clip? How it has that little hook there? See, my shirt got caught underneath that. So, be mindful of that. Okay. Be mindful of that. Let's put it back in. Put it back in. There we go. All right, we got that. We got that. Okay, now push it to the front. Looks good from the front. Tell something is there, but don't know what. Who cares? No printing. Everything looks good. Okay. Situation appears. Eyes on the target. And there we are. Okay. All right. So, I am feeling and liking this holster. It's pretty good. I like this. So, kudos to Versacare for this particular holster. And that's all that I have for today. I just wanted to show you guys that real quickly. Um, again, thank you guys so much for everything. Thank you guys for just being on this journey with me. Um, it really means a lot. All right. So uh, to my next review, you guys take care. Stay cool. <laughs> and stay hydrated. But I took my next review of my next video. You guys take care. And I'll see you soon.